Woohoo! Welcome in, pile on in here. Who's all joining us today? Welcome in. Let's see, who again? Cody. Who else is here? Welcome in, dudes. Welcome in. Four likes. Uh, this is zero people watching, but I know that's not true. Everybody's probably watching the ad. Welcome in, guys. Welcome in. Let's switch over to monitor this year. We'll get started nice and early here. I think we're good to go. I'll give everybody just a few minutes here to pile on in. I might adjust the game volume a little bit for myself. It's a little loud. Uh, excuse me. Turn that down. It feels like it's a little loud. How's that? How's that sound? Nicholas, how you doing, dude? Welcome in. How's everybody doing? Put this away for a second. Kind of quickly show you guys the village here that we're working out of. Sounds good? Okay. So we have... Oh, I need to turn my HUD back on. Um, toggle HUD. Apply. Okay. Here we go. We got the fish market. We have a grocery store. Up here we have cafe just over here down the corner i have a bait and tackle shop time to fish yes it is logan how you doing man welcome in tackle store um i'm gonna i might return something i bought some stuff that i don't think i can actually use yet um yeah i can't use this guy yet so might as well return them. I don't know that I can do anything with them. Uh, out the lake fishing now. Yep, we are in Russia. Want to talk about it? <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, yeah, we're in Russia. Dude, there's bears in this game. I'm a little terrified that we might um, just be fishing, chilling here by the lakeside fishing. You ran up on by a bear. Um, so, so far, all we have really is um, spinners and stuff that we could use. I think spinners and spoons. So, we'll see how that goes. I, I did catch one last night, right about the same time we're at right now. Well, the time in this game seems to go by really quick. So, we'll see how it goes. It's kind of already getting to nighttime. I started to have something there, I think. I think I got one. Yeah, I got something on the line there. We cut something real little there right at the end. Look at that. Perch. Uh, 74 gram? Yeah, definitely not our PB, but... Yeah, that's how you make money in this game. You, you catch the fish and you go sell them either at the fish market or the cafe, whichever. And then... Uh, the cafe kind of like takes like orders, so they'll do like a, a, a order of four perch. Um, or, you know, six of this and two of this or whatever. And you sell to them, they pay you a lot of money, or you sell it to the fish market for like 50 cents or something like that per fish or something like that. I've seen it as low as like 7 cents for some, some basic fish, but. So, yep, it felt like 195, dude, oh my gosh, it was 80 driving home at 10, 10 p.m. It was nuts. Couldn't believe it. I guess Friday's supposed to be 94 freaking degrees outside here in Ohio. I'm not excited about that. Anytime it gets above like 80, I I start hating life. 85, 90, I, I, I hate it. Let's try this little dock here. So we're just kind of throwing some spinners. I do have some other spinners here. Uh, I don't have, I can't use that spoon yet. I'm not really even sure what's the best to be using for what times. Maybe you guys are better with the, uh, the colors and stuff for time of day that I am. I know, I, I believe silver's better at night, gold's better during the day. The graphics are, are honestly pretty solid on this, you're right. I mean, the graphs could be a little better, I mean, there's some, some weirdness, but I mean, in terms of, like, the fishing part of it, like, it feels, it feels realistic. It's probably the best fishing simulator game I think I've played. I, I mean, the only, like, really downside to it is you are in Russia and a lot of the stuff is written in Russia. Or written in Russian, I should say. So, I mean, you kind of get to deal with that. I mean, your line can get snagged on stuff. Like, it's pretty realistic. That would be fishing your docks and your trees and your wheat. Yep. Yep, yep. 
Um, yeah, I mean, I, I think for line, we're pretty limited to what we have on there right now, which I think is like a four or five pound line. It's just what I've unlocked so far. I'm a level four so far. That's in the bottom left-hand corner. You can see that. It shows you what level I am. Kind of want to move. We'll come around here. I had some luck the other day over in this area, I think. We'll try this out near these lily pads. Basically, you start off with this little spinning reel, and you get um, just kind of a, a stick, basically. Watercolor. Yeah, I'm not sure what what to call this water. It's pretty pretty green, I'd say. It's pretty dark. Not real high visibility by any means. I might need to up the reel speed a little bit for this spinner. I can't tell. It kind of looks like I need to up the reel speed. And you can you can change that. It's, so once I get that out there, if we go R and then retrieval speed, so we can turn that up to like 35, say. Try that out. Maybe that'll give it a little bit better action. You could jerk. You could do all that. Pretty cool. I, I, like it, As far as fishing games go, I mean... I don't know how much better it gets. So, I mean, we're all we have right now is spinners. So I'm limited to, I have a gold, I have kind of a white, I have some silver, and I have a blue. Let me try the white one. Obviously, there's boatloads. I'll, I'll go through the tackle shop here in a little bit just so you guys can kind of see what all we have to work with. Right, there's a ton. Hey, Nicholas, no worries, man. Have a great night. Um, see you tomorrow night, hopefully. Um, tomorrow night, I'm not exactly sure. We might be finishing up grabbing equipment for the Big Flats. I, I screwed up our other Big Flats Texas save, if I'm being honest with you guys. I forgot to exit out of it last Thursday, so it ran all weekend. And we missed, like, four days worth of work, so a lot of our crops are dead or withered. And, yeah, kind of screwed us. So that one might might be an abandoned ship. We'll see, though. Pretty nice farm, though. So, I mean, I hate to completely abandon it, but obviously we have infinite money, so we can do whatever we decide to do. But we'll try over here. Best I've seen yet? Yeah, I mean, it's good. It really is good. White blue would give you Right, right. Yeah, it sucks. I, I don't know what we're gonna do about the big floods, Texas. I might just uh cheat the fields back or something. I don't know. I hate to I don't wanna re reharvest all those big ass fields is the only thing. Honestly that map's a lot to chew in single player, so I, it might not just be might not be the best map for us in single player to be honest. So we'll see. Obviously this is just a starter rod and reel. It seems to work pretty good, though. Definitely. I got 15 fish in my inventory right now, so it's uh, not too bad. I've, oh, there we go. We got one. Here we go. He kind of bit it as we were just reeling in. Uh, 294 gram. Hey, we're level 5. Cool. Look at that. Uh, hey, new spinner. Cool. So every level up, you get something new. So we'll try that out and see if it's any better than what we're using right now. It might very well be. It's good to try them out anyway. Seems to cast nice. I'm not sure what the right uh, speed is for it, but we'll figure that out as we go here. Yeah, I mean, it's nice. It's chill. It's, it's exactly what you want from a fishing game. You could definitely sit here and zone out for hours and just cast. Have a good time with it. Let me try the other rod out here. Uh, and there's rod holders and stuff too, so if I go to the other rod, what we can do is we can cast it out and then put it in a rod holder. It's just, you know, one of these sticks with a bobber on the end, really. Um, there we go. There you go. We could just watch that bobber. It's pretty cool. Yep. 
slower and you're on a boat. Oh, you can actually get fish out of a boat on this as well. Oops, something's grabbing that bobber. We might want to stick this in the pod there. Although it's not going to get any bites like that, so we'll see. It was going under. I don't know if it's going to. You could reel the rod in while it's in the holder. Right now I'm reeling this one in. Pretty nice. Horny hat guy, welcome in, dude. What's up? Um, oh, wait, I wasn't reeling in. I was holding the wrong button. I was holding E and E's to pick it up. Y's to reel it in. Oops. Oh, well. Doesn't look like anything's biting that one anyway, so. Yeah, you can get a bunch of these. Oh, I'm doing all right, man. How are you? I just realized that's Flusher Puddle. What's up, dude? How you doing, man? What a weird name for you. <laughs> How you doing, buddy? What's up, man? It's starting to get dark out here. So this ought to be fun. I do have a flashlight, but obviously not the best flashlight. It'll work, but I'm not loving this lure. Oop, hey, that bobber just went under. Uh, yeah, give me that. I think there's a fish on there. There is. Look at that. Little baby Rufy. I don't think we have these in the States. 26 grams. He's tiny. 9 centimeters. I feel like that's, that's really small. Good catch, though. We'll take it. Eventually, you can make lures and uh, all that stuff. Uh, what fish is there? Uh, there's a ton, dude. Um, I'd have to open up Steam to go through all the different fish in the game, but there's a ton. There's a ton. So far, I think I've caught perch, bluegill, um, those little roofies. Um, I think of what else. There's a there's a ton. I. Oop, hey, that's going under again. Take that. Hey, we got him. Looks like another little roofie. Bet Steve for the first time. I saw that, dude. Another 26 gram. Yeah, nice little guy. Yeah, there's bass. There's all sorts of stuff. Uh, let me try a different bait. I'm using a blood worm right now. Maybe if I go for a different bait, we'll catch something a little bit bigger on this guy. We'll see. Uh, I keep hitting O instead of zero. I need to hit zero for the rod holder. There we go. Yep, there's bass. There's walleye. There's catfishing. Yep. So that right there looks like a catfish ring to me. That's basically what you'd use. Uh, although I've never seen anybody do it without a reel. I don't know if you can put a reel on that rod. It's a 14-foot rod, so I don't think you can. It's a, it's a big rod. I don't know what you'd use that for. Obviously, what we're doing right now, but like I don't, I've never seen anyone use one of those here. Um, I'm trying to think what else there is. I mean, there, there's all sorts of stuff. All sorts of stuff. I can go on. And there's other other ponds too. Like th this is just a starter pond. You could pay to travel to other places and fish. And there's tons. There's a bus stop. So far, I've only fished this pond, so like I don't know what else is out there. Ooh. Got a little bobber dance going on. I feel like a fish just bumped that maybe. I don't think there's one hooked. Game is this Russian fishing for Johnny. Russian fishing for Yep, a little break from farming. We've been busy. I, I, so what we've started doing is every Wednesday, I just kind of play whatever random game I feel like playing. This one popped up and it was free, so I figured I'd give it a shot. This is free on PC, by the way. If anyone's on PC and wants it, hop on Steam and go give it a download. Give it a shot. It's actually really good. Really, really good. I want to try uh, um, Call of the Wild the Angler just to see how good it is. Damn it, another fish just bumped that. Something definitely just bumped that. I didn't see it go under, but... 
Oh, there it is. Uh, oh, put this down. Put this down before he gets off. Oh, he already. He definitely already got away. Build on American Falls. I don't want to do American Falls because it's not available to everyone. I I could, but I, I don't want to do that. And I I yeah I don't I don't want to do that. I would, but if it gets put on Mod Hub, which supposedly it might still get get to Mod Hub, we'll see. Then we'll do it, but I don't want to do that, and then. Yeah, I'd never be available to everybody. I don't feel like that's fair. Obviously, PC players have it, but... I don't feel like that's fair. I feel like that's kind of a tease, you know what I mean? Um, that, and there's so much drama around the map right now, I, I don't want to do it. It's I, Yeah, it's still up on Mod Network. I don't think... That's not from Lancey, though. Lancey didn't put that up there. Bobber's doing the dance again. See if these... I have not. I would like to try it. Bobber's doing the dance. I don't think there's anything on it, but... It's definitely bouncing around there. There it goes. I'm going to be too late by the time I get it. Yep, too late. Or yeah, yeah, I know. It, it's it's to my discretion to be better than that, though. You know what I mean? Like I feel like it's partly my responsibility to be better and not encourage that. If you know what I mean, as a content creator, I feel like it's it's part of the obligation. It's it's not the right thing to do. If you guys want to download it and play with it, by all means, but I, I don't want to be the one encouraging mod sites that are stealing for modders. You know what I mean? It's one thing if a modder uploads it to the mod site. It's another if somebody random uploads it there for downloads so they make money off of it. You know what I mean? I, I know the 1025 is going to end up on a third-party site, but, like, it's... It is what it is, but like, especially with everything that Lancey Boy in particular is going through, I don't want to be the one to make it worse. I'd really prefer that he just comes back to doing what he does. More than the mower deck? Uh, I don't know if it'd, it'd be dancing more than that. That'd be hard to beat. If I give this some action or something, maybe if that help. I'm not really catching anything tonight. Might go try a different spot. I thought we'd try this spot for a minute. I was doing all right here the other day. The other good spot I had found was... Um, drag us in. Reeling in too quick. I can slow it down a little bit, but... Message him after the stream. I talked to him a little bit this morning. Just for a minute. A couple messages back and forth, and... Uh, He's just got a lot going on. This game's free, Jason. It's free on Steam if you're on PC. We'll give it a download. It's it's pretty good. Got a spinner on the, on the other rod, yes. On this rod, it's obviously just a worm and a bobber. Uh, let me loop around this way. I was having some luck over here in this corner last uh, the other night when I was playing. I tried this out after we did Call of the Wild last Wednesday, and I quite liked it. Because I was thinking about buying the angler. But I wanted to try this out since it was free. Uh, that's not deep enough. I need to adjust that. You can adjust the float depth, which is cool. The... Feeling slow with the spinner might. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. Um... How do I adjust the float height on this? I need to check the controls real quick. Um, there's a ton in here. It, there's 
and you have to eat and stuff. Like it's it's legit. Um, quick help. I just. Um, float depth. It's numpad plus or minus. Well, I don't have a numpad plus or minus, so that sucks. Uh, maybe we just throw it out that way. That looks alright. Go with that. Uh, bust the rod back out. Uh, you... Did I leave it in the rod holder? I might have left it over there. Uh-oh. That's not good. Don't leave your rods. Don't want to do that. That's not good. Where did I leave it? It's so dark. It's kind of scary out here. I don't think I... Did I go all the way around? I might have. Did I go across the bridge? I can't remember. Where did I leave my rod? That would really suck if I lost my rod. I don't want to do that. Where is it? I'm kind of panicking right now. This is not good. Uh, I feel like the spot I was at with... Oh, there it is. Right there. I got it. Take rod. There we go. Chop, there's a bear. Yeah, probably. Probably, dude. There legit is bears in this game, and they will fucking eat you. I haven't gotten eaten yet, but I saw a video of another dude playing this on YouTube and dude legit got ate by a bear while he was fishing. Like, we're in middle of wild, wild Russia. I mean, this is the town. Like, there's like five huts here. That's the whole thing. Uh, that's the boat you could take out, by the way. I think I still have... Yeah, I still have my boat pass. I can still ride in it. Uh, I don't want to go out on the boat, though. Don't die. I'll try not to. It's it's sketchy out here, though. We'll say that. I still have my boat pass, so we can get the boat later. Maybe we'll wait for morning and try the boat. I wasn't having a whole lot of luck in the boat, though, if I'm being honest. So I don't know how well it would go tonight. There we go. Let's slow the retrieval speed down a little bit. Try 25. I think this is pretty slow. I wish it would tell you, like, kind of what retrieval speed you need to go for for each lure. That'd be kind of helpful. Like a recommended range. If you had, like, a high and a low to go for. New movie coming out about dogs. Oh, that's cool. Down for a new Will Ferrell movie. Uh, let me try a different spinner, too. Maybe this new guy will have some more luck. I feel like gold should be good at night, or silver should be good at night, one of the two. Something very reflective. Hey, 11 people watching. That's a little better than I thought we'd do tonight, being a game that nobody really knows about. It's, it doesn't have a ton of downloads on Steam. It's pretty, pretty under the radar. I see. I was looking for fishing games to try out, and this one, this one came up. It looks pretty good. I mean, I've, I've had fun with it so far. We do need to eat soonish. You can see my little food bar down the bottom left there. I think you should be able to see that. But yeah, you have food and energy. Like you need to eat and sleep and take care. You have a health bar. You know what I mean? Like. How many times do you see a health bar in a fishing game? I feel like... I, I know Angler... Call the Wild Angler is going to be a little bit more arcadey than this. This is very, very simulation. So I do want to try it just to see... Like, it might be easier to catch fish in that game than this one, but... I do feel like this one's very rewarding when you do catch something. Try out that way. That and the equipment in this seems like very, very legit. There is some real brands in here as well. Not stuff that I'm like super familiar with because I don't feel like we have as much of the, the brands in the US. It's a lot of Russian brands, but they are legit brands. 
That's pretty cool. Oh, there we go. We got something. Look at that. As soon as... Hey, a little 91 gram perch. As soon as, like, we started getting some daylight, I feel like they just don't bite much at night. I haven't had a ton of luck night fishing. Let's say that. Yeah, there's, uh... There's all sorts of forums and stuff on this game. People talk about it. You can see the records popping up on the left where people have what they caught. Big catfish and stuff like that. I feel like for the most part, this pond, I've, it's, it's been mostly... Ooh, we got a fighter here. Might need to up the... Up the brake a little bit. Yeah, he's a, he's a good fighter. Here we go. That's a big guy. I got him upside down now. I think we should be able to get him. Yeah, 475 gram perch. That's a big one. I, I don't I don't even think it sucks, honestly. I think it's really good. I think it's, honestly, if you're looking for simulation with fishing, uh, this is as, probably as about as good as it gets. I know there's... What's the other one? Um, I can't remember proficiency or something like that pro fishing whatever I don't know I, I I tried that I wasn't a huge fan feels like there's a lot of pay to win going on like they want you to spend a lot of your real money on it and I'm not a huge fan of my there's as far as I could tell I haven't found a single microtransaction yet so I'm pretty happy with that I really can't stand microtransactions, to be honest with you. That's, that's one of my biggest pet peeves. We've got another one. There we go. Like, so as soon as daylight rolled around, it's, they start catching a whole lot easier, it feels like. Maybe it's just I don't have the right lure for, sh for fishing at night yet. 332 gram. Cool. Let me catch, like, maybe... Yeah, we'll go until they stop biting in this spot, and then... We'll uh, check out the tackle shop and I'll sell these fish off and make some money. See if there's anything new we unlocked in the tackle shop. You really have to fish a The other part, of it, there's a lot of skills, so like you have to really get good with spinners to like really unlock all the spinners that you can get. Um, and to unlock like spoons, you have to excel with spinners. You know what I mean? Like stuff like that there's there's a whole skill tree like it's it's kind of like an rpg game and a fishing game if they had a baby it's really kind of cool in that regard so it's pretty interesting definitely very different what you'd expect it's very deep there's a lot to it they really uh they really did a lot to make this game as realistic as they could of course, you 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 don't like earn skills when you level up. You earn skills by catching more fish, you know, which is exactly how it should work. So that's pretty neat. Uh, this is twelve point four degrees Celsius. I feel like that's fairly good fishing weather, right? Twelve point four C. What is that Fahrenheit? Like fifty six. 40 something. Maybe a little cold. Oh, we got one. Another perch. Pitching a lot of perch today. Yeah. Another 332 gram. I don't know if there's a way to convert the units to English. If there is, I might do that. I kind of doubt it. It's actually made by an American developer company i believe so like it's russian fishing but like it's made by americans that like actually understand it you know oop he got something tipping the bobber there yeah that's going under um the rod he's poking it Give him a second to really sink his teeth in there. Maybe. Come on, little buddy. You know you want it.
Come on. Get a hold of it. 54 Fahrenheit. Oh, that's about right. Come on. Sink your teeth on the thing. Quit nibbling it. Oh, too quick. Damn. Uh, we might move to a different spot. Uh... Try this corner here. This looks like a good spot for this. Sucks that I don't have a numpad, so I can't adjust the float height. I didn't see a way to change the setting. Yeah, the fish was just like poking at it. He really wasn't sure what to think about it. It's not deep enough. I'm too, uh, too high on my float. Oh, I need a numpad to adjust it. <laughs> but, I mean, there are some issues like that, you know? Like, there's no... I don't think you can change the key binds, which is kind of annoying, but... There's a fish dryer and a campfire over here. I haven't even been over here. This is kind of cool. You could craft here. Need to start a fire. Uh, not found firewood. Fish dryer. Huh. Smokehouse. So we can do smoked fish, brazier, shish kebab. Oh my goodness, I have I literally haven't even looked at this. E to open the tent. I think this is where you can sleep. And st yeah, you can store stuff in here. It's pretty nifty. Um, yeah, I literally haven't haven't even looked at this. This is pretty pretty neat. Not gonna lie. Or just watch attack fish. Yeah, right. Well, that's fun enough to do, right? That's pretty cool. I mean, it's it's definitely a, a neat take on a, a fishing game. I'll say that. It's not what I expected. Uh, where did I leave that rod at? Oh, relaxing. Yeah. Back was itching. Um. I was over here, wasn't I? I keep doing that. I keep leaving my rod behind. I quit leaving my rod behind. Tackle box with the logo? I do. I have stickers, so I can actually put a logo on my tackle box. Although my tackle box is made of cloth, so I don't know how well that would work. In game, I don't think you actually have a tackle box, per se. I don't know. I haven't actually looked. Let me, let me try one more time here to see if we can't catch anything in this area. And then we'll... Go ahead and try the, uh, might get hung up in that tall grass here. I hope not. I'm getting snagged for sure. I really didn't want to put it over there. And yeah, you get better at casting and stuff as you go too. So you'll be able to cast farther and stuff like that. Stitch it on. I don't know how well that would work. Something's aggravating that bobber again. That thing's swimming with it. There's no fish on it either. That's annoying. Ah, oh, screw it. Well, it's... It's really not deep enough over here. For this rod. I definitely want to go check out the tackle shop real quick, though. I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to stick this guy in the ground. Maybe we come back and there's a catfish on it. Maybe we'll get lucky. Let's uh, run up here. I want to go check out this tackle shop and we can offload some of the fish we have while we're up there. Hopefully my rod doesn't end up on the other side of the pond. That would suck. Uh, and there is a zoom too, so you can... Oh, I was zoomed in already. I didn't realize I was zoomed in. Was I? No, I wasn't. Yeah, so you can kind of zoom in, check on it as you're going. It's kind of nice. Um, let's run over here, over yonder. Tackle store. What do you got for me? Get on the boat if you... Yeah, totally could. There's kits... These aren't too bad. 
A little expensive. I only have 26 currency. Um, really can't afford much of this stuff. Um, obviously not getting any, but I mean, yeah, you could see the amount of rods, right? Like, I mean, it's nuts. And some of these get super expensive. Like the, this one's 17,000. You can get it different colors you, if you want, you know, or different lengths and actions and all that stuff, which is really cool. Um, different reels. We have this one right now for eight bucks. Can't even afford the cheapest next up reel. The one we have actually isn't too bad. That only goes up 0.1 kilos in terms of drag. So, I mean, really, it's not even worth it right now anyway. You'd be better off waiting and going with, like, the express fishing down there or something like that. Yeah. Hey, Cameron, how you doing, dude? Yeah, bait casters in here. You got fly fishing. You got... I mean, you name it, they're in here. All sorts of stuff. Like I said, some of these are real brands, too. Uh, I believe Reef is a real brand. SAT, I believe, is a real brand. Um, yeah, some of, a lot of this is real. Um, I don't think that there's any of the real fishing line. Um, but yeah, tons of line. You could order it in different col uh different quantities and stuff hooks different colored hooks all sorts of different types of hooks i don't even know how half of these work to be honest I have a mess of that you got some jig heads i don't think we can do jigs yet um spinner selection got like quite the selection in here spoons i mean i could go i could go for a while here Help you out this cut this cord. Yeah, you're on your own. I'm fishing. Different hard plastic or hard plastics and then soft plastics. I mean, it goes for a while. We're just barely skimming the top here. Crystal beads. You could add beads to your line. Um, live baits. All sorts of different stuff. I believe you could turn fish that you catch into live bait too, if you want. Like the uh, yeah these. Um, perch that we're catching we could technically turn into turn into live bait um i mean it's deep like i said it's it's deep right, craft baits just tag no legacy today he's here he's just not talking you got dynamite probably um sinkers you see it like i, I could go it's, it's going to take me a while to get through all these. You got leader lines. Um, lead cores. So you can make leaders if you want. Swivels. Um, you can actually buy these bells and put them on your. Uh, I might buy one of these because I think you could put it on that rod whenever you're starting to get a bite feeders ground bait um, binoculars down here got a camping light throwing stick you got a slingshot dude got freaking slingshots in here man it's crazy it gets deep alt F4 yeah right um eat yeah cool so I, you get a free hot meal per day so you might as well walk up here and and that's per real life day not per in game day yeah i don't even like know where to start to buy stuff to like help improve you know what i mean like it, there's just so much um we'll go up here to the cafe because here we could sell you can frog gig um I don't have enough of these. Um, these guys, I don't have enough of. I need five. 
Um, yeah, I mean it's deep. So we'll come down here. Let's uh, we'll sell the sell a lot of this stuff because it's not worth anything now. I, I should have sold all this before I backed out of the game the other day. You want to sell it because otherwise it goes bad. Not really worth much. Kind of sucks. You have to be very careful about how long you keep it in your inventory. It goes off real in game or real life days, not in game days. Kind of crazy. Um, yeah, you saw a bunch of the different species that were in there. Uh, maybe if I open this back up, you could see. Um, some of the different species. Let me check the cafe here real quick. Yeah, Chinese sleeper, roach, bream, uh, roof, bleak, common carp, mirror carp. There's another bream, um, another common carp order. Is it frogs? Uh, I don't even know what you do to catch a frog in this game. I haven't even looked at that. Yeah, I feel like I could spend like all day digging through this store looking for stuff. I don't. I still don't have much money. I was hoping I'd be able to buy this. I want to buy this, uh, this lure kit. Spinning baits. Yeah, I feel like this would be really handy. It's got a bunch of different stuff in it. You can purchase gold coins if you want to buy stuff quicker, but... Um, where would the frog shit be? How do I catch a frog? I kind of want to catch a frog. How in the hell do you even do that? Wacky worm. Um, ground baits, maybe? So ground baits, you probably pour on the ground, right? And it makes them want to come to you. I really don't know how that works. So yeah, you can buy these, I think, and pour them on the ground. I had no idea how to do that. Um... You could probably make your own too, I imagine. Attractant sunflower oil. Who knows what's the best to use, right? Um, boat rods. Oh, you could actually buy rods for going in the boat with. Wow, 30,000. $2,000 for a boat rod. Wow. It's expensive. Um, I mean, if, huh. Cool. Yeah, I mean, the amount of stuff that's in here, I mean, it's, it's a lot. Rods. Spinning rods, casting rods, feeder rods. Picker rods, match rods, jerking rods, carp rods, spot rods, marker. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a five motor coming along. <laughs> Imagine he comes out of the woodwork. Reels. I mean, there's so much. I wish I knew what half this stuff was for. Uh, that's my keep net. I, I kind of want to see. I think I have some food for myself in here. Yeah, I did buy myself food. Tickets for a one day boat rental. Mosquito Lake map. Um, crafting. I haven't even messed with any of this. Pretty wet bed is bread is bait. Potato cubes. Being bad. Statistics. Oh yeah, here you go. You can see what the record catches are. Strongest contestant was this perch, apparently. Record catch was this gibble carp. Catch with the float tackle was the gibble carp. Record catch with the spinning tackle was the 
this perch here. Um, I haven't broken any rods yet. I've only lost one fish. I've caught 39 so far. Um, skills. These are cool. So, spin fishing you have. I think you can actually... Yeah, I have four available points here. So, we can... We spend a point here. Point here. Oh, I kind of want to spend a lot of this on spinning because that's what I do a lot of at the moment. Um... Float fishing, maybe we should spend a lot on. Distance accurate with see with the spinning rod. Yeah, let's do that. I mean, spinning is really where, where we're going to spend most of our time, right? So. Um. I'm out of points, so let's try that. I imagine that's going to make things a little bit easier on us. Uh, rod is too far. Where's my rod? Did I leave them both over there? I don't think I did. Did I leave them both over there? I didn't think I did. Oh, shoot. Oh, I guess I did. Oh, well. All right, I'm back over there. Uh, maybe that'll make us a little bit, a little bit better. Who knows? Um, there we go. Try it out. Yeah, I mean, there's entire skill trees and stuff you can level up and get better at. It's, it's honestly really cool. Very interesting concept on the, a fishing game that I can't say I've seen before. Um, first cast got nothing. Oh, right there. You see that? He's still over here. Turn the speed down a little bit. There he is. Yep, got him. Ha <laughs> ha, sucker. Probably has messaged me and I just haven't seen it yet. Ooh, do you see that over there? Or am I crazy? I swear I just saw something swimming across the top over there. Might be the first I've seen of a fish out that far swimming around. He's nibbling. Bite it, dude. He's nibbling. Come on, grab that sucker. We get him? I think we got him. No? No. They get nothing. I'm crazy. Name three times. It's weird that he hasn't yet. I totally figured he would have. I don't know if his motor in the background is screwing with this at all. I don't know how that works in game. If it makes any difference. I don't know how much sound matters. It might totally matter, and I just don't know it. I feel like there's something right in there we keep getting hung up on. Maybe we can't hit right. Yeah, that'd be a little scary, huh? Just have a legacy pop up in your room. Legacy, legacy, legacy. Where are you at, dude? Nothing. Um, that bobber's dancing again. 
feel like there might be totally be a fish on there. Oh yeah, there's totally. Damn it. Uh, I'm gonna do the smart thing this time, and I was trying to put the thing away, but. Chinese sleeper. Hey, look at that. I don't think I've caught one of these guys yet. He's kind of cool looking, isn't he? I love that color. It looks a lot like a bass, but... He's pretty cool looking. Uh, I, I wanted to see something real quick. Um... Can you change... The... No, it doesn't look like you can. I was hoping I could put it in uh, English units. Looked like a gold. Yeah, it kind of did, didn't it? Hey, Trevor, what's up, dude? How you doing, bud? There you go. Let's try this one more time. Oh, he was kind of cool looking. Chinese slipper. I can't say I've seen one of those before. I imagine that's because they're probably in China. China, Russia, stuff like that. Who knows? Ooh, I got one. It's another Chinese sleeper by chance. Now, what are you? Looks like it might be. I don't know. Eyed. Huh. He's cool looking too. I like the red fins on him. Looks really cool. We're catching some weird ones today. It's pretty cool. Catching some weird ones. I don't think I've caught an eye yet. Oh, that Chinese slipper. Pretty neat. So I like this a lot. It's, 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 it's definitely interesting. Oh, goodness. That just went under like a sack of potatoes. Holy crap. Pick that up. Oh, he's gone. Sucker. Damn it, I couldn't put the rod down quick enough. Dang, I might need to monitor this guy. Making me a little nervous. Uh, let me get a better cast out. I really don't know how I feel about this uh, telescopic rod. I don't think it's my favorite. I definitely feel like I prefer the spinning. I, although it seems like I'm catching bigger fish on the telescopic, so I don't know. There's a balance. I feel like it's kind of boring, though, just watching the bobber. Especially for a stream. I kind of want to go out in the boat again, though. One nibble in me? Slow it down a little bit. Bite that sucker, will ya? I don't see him. He's down there. I don't see him. Yeah, I don't know. It is just the bobber getting snagged up. Who knows? Uh, let that retrieval speed a little bit. Fishy gamer, fish around. That exploded Russian. Yeah, that would be interesting, huh? It might be in this game. I don't know. I haven't uh, left this pond yet. I kind of want to soon, though. Just to go see what else is out there. Although I feel like we should probably get our equipment up a little bit better before we leave this pond, so I don't know. All right, we could go explore around a little bit, see what else we find. Oop. I got another bite on this one. And I think I got one trying to bite that one. Damn it. Come on. Get him on the shore. Oh, he gets off, right? I definitely drag him on the shore already, right? Oh, he totally got off. That bobber's totally underwater. He... Dude... This sucks. It's hard. Uh, how do I put these away? I need to put it away. 
hate is your hook. Yeah. Yeah, I don't love the... I feel like I probably need a bigger hook on this, to be honest, too. That might help, but I don't know how to put a bigger hook on it. Um... How do I... Maybe if I... Uh, 16, 14, 12. How do I... I don't know how this works. Inventory. I don't know how to add this. I have no idea how this works. Oh, here we go. Size 16 hook on there. So if I go to maybe a size 12. And then we could change the bobber as well. I don't know if either of these is any better, but... Um, leader... Bait... Bait... Seven pound lined on it right now. Okay, I, I get it now. So you go into here using seven pound line. We haven't unlocked the ability to use leaders yet. I don't think so. Okay, well, cool, interesting. Oh, and then you can check your wear and everything on stuff. So the reel has a little bit of wear on the gears or on the mechanism. Okay. Interesting. Cool. Um, yeah, I want to go explore around a little bit. I want to see if there's another pond nearby or anything like that. I haven't really ventured out at all. I don't know, like, what's around. Um, it doesn't look like there's any other water nearby. It looks like the deep part of the pond, though, is out there at 8. So maybe we try to fish the deeper part. Turn this way. Okay, so right out here is the deep part. I don't think I could cast out far enough to hit the deep part. Oh, I need to bait. Uh, let me go to this. I didn't want to put that down. I wanted to swap to my other reel. Apparently, you put it in the rod holder if you put it down, though. Huh. Interesting. I don't think we're quite getting to the deep part of the pond there yet. A little deeper, though. Huh. It's a long way all the way around the pond. I'll probably run back that way. I want to try to see if there's... There's, like, a bus stop. I don't know if there's a way to get on a bus and go somewhere else. I don't know how much money it costs. I have no idea. I'm learning with you guys. Figuring it all out together. Me. Open my claws. I thought like suit. <laughs> That's a little scary. I'm alone tonight. That is a little, little creepy, dude. Uh, okay, so let me put this one back. Let me put this one back. There we go. So now I should put it in the rod holder. Okay, so if I go, I want to run back around the pond. I, wanna, I think I saw a bus stop. I, I wonder if that's how you get to the next area. The other thing we could do is hop out in the boat and try fishing in the middle of the pond if there's not. Not a way to leave yet. I don't know how it works. So I do know you have to be concerned about food, though. And maybe you walk along this path to get somewhere else? Like, I don't know. I'm learning as we go here. Um, yeah, I don't have anything in my tent, so that's that's fine. This is my tent, apparently. This is definitely a learning experience. 
like Josh said though, I, I love the graphics. Like as far as like the basics of the game go, like it's it's pretty cool. Um, I saw a bus stop or something somewhere. Um, tackle store. This is hot food. Food is not available. Maybe up here? I don't know, dude. We're going to figure this out. Map. Go on this way. So I wonder if we keep going this way if I where I'll end up at. If I just keep following this way. I'm learning. I'm learning. Play Legacy Ball. Where does this go? Can I keep going this way? No, I can't keep going this way. There's a horse around here. So you can't just keep going that way. Huh. So then you just go back down and around, I guess? I don't know, dude. I don't know how this works. Looks like there's some stuff up here. I don't know if this... Is this the, where the horses are? There's a tractor. Hey, we're, we're farming, guys. Check out my new tractor. Workshop. Okay. Imagine the workshop's where you repair your stuff. Uh, I have Venmo, but it's a personal account. I'd prefer to not hand out that info. Oh, you could taxidermy your fish, too? Oh, that's cool. Taxidermy shop. I'm exploring. I haven't haven't looked around here yet. No idea how any of this administration. Get spare float tackle. Get spare spinning tackle. Free tackles available once a day. Okay. So you get another map here if you need it. Oh, this is my house, huh? Huh. Interesting. Uh, I do have PayPal. That's that's kind of what I tend to stick with. Place for an item. Place for an item. What do you put in here? Awards. Sit down. Ooh, okay. So is this like a... Oh, it's all in Russian. That's not very helpful. How do I get up? Guitar. Kind of strumming it. This clock is really loud. It's all Russian cartoons, let's go! It's too drink up. Okay. <laughs> This is in the game. A tip website won't let you, huh? <laughs> what is this? Russian cartoons. Okay. Interesting. Start a fire. Place for an item. Place for rewards. Huh. This is, uh... Wait, oh, you can place your rods and reels up here? Okay. Cool, so I guess like if you start to get a bunch of rods and reels stacked up, you can stash them all on here. Cool. <laughs> that was very, very unexpected, I'll say. It's cool to know I have a house, though. Combines. This might be crossing. Uh, not very many. Um, It does happen, though, I'm sure. What else is around here? What is what here? So that goes the way we were trying to go before, right? Yeah. Can't go that way. Figure that out. Uh, interesting. Okay. Well, we're learning. We're learning. We're figuring stuff out. We're seeing what's what. Can you go in here? What's this? Nothing? Just a little cabin? Huh. So how do you leave this... 
area. Do you... I wonder if you could take... Follow the water. Maybe that's how you go to the next area. Nothing is lagging tonight. Yeah, apparently it's nice tonight. This game seems to run really well. I'll say that as well. I think I'm on max graphics settings as well. Uh, video. Yeah, I'm at 1440. Graphics. Um, I could turn them up to... Uh, let me try that. Superior. Okay, that's a little laggier. Let me... I need to see what my frame rates are. It's a little laggier, but... I mean, it's pretty. So I wasn't even on max graphics. Let me go... Let me go to beautiful. See how that runs. That looks even nicer. I mean, obviously, superior is the best, but this looks even nicer than it was when we were starting. It does look a little laggy, though. So maybe, maybe where I had it was probably the best place. Good, I mean, good looks good anyway. So I'm not going to complain. I mean, for only being on good graphics, I mean. Uh, let me real quick see the difference between... Um, Put it on superior again. Can you see inside the water any better? No, not really. Okay. Wondering if there was any advantages to being on higher graphics. All right. Anyway, GTX 1060. Oh yeah, you could run it on on just about a potato then. Although it'd probably be a little heavy for your girlfriend's computer then, right? Because she's on what a 980 or something like that, right? I mean, recommended is one thing, too. Probably can run it. I mean, it looks pretty good in good quality, so I'm not, I'm not complaining. Don't mock the potato. <laughs> I won't mock the potatoes. I have a potato myself, so. RX 580. Yeah, so that's probably a little lower. I mean, a 1060 and an RX 580 are probably about the same, right? I would imagine. I want to see what happens if you keep going this way. Because I think this is where the map's going to start. No, it's the other way that goes on. Oh, I ran the wrong way. Uh, oh, well, let's try right here. Get back to fishing. I have a bamboo rod. What do I do with this? I just got this for free, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> a bamboo rod. Old fishing line, okay. Feather float, okay. Um, I have a rusty hook. I'll put the size 14 one on there and then we'll throw a... Cymbalina, it's a doe, I guess. I literally have a bamboo rod. Can I catch a fish on It's the question, though. Can I catch a fish with a bamboo rod and a feather for a bobber? We have to try it, right? This will probably be the rod that I catch a fucking monster on. This is some real, like, survival fishing crap right here, dude. Catch a fish, you must swim with the fishes. Dude, in real life, that's me. That's me. That's what I was doing uh, Saturday or Sunday when I was fishing. I was literally like out in the water. There was freaking uh, shiners up biting my toes. Trying to nibble uh, sand and shit off my toes. Can we catch a fish with this? That's a real question. Fly fishing pole? That's something. That's a something. Here, fishy, fishy. Yeah. Are we going to catch anything right here? I'm going to put it in a rod holder. Screw it. If I lose this one, I'm not going to be that upset about it. Um, pull this guy out again. Try actually fishing with this thing. Level up. Oh, you, you do level up a little bit with it. It's just you don't level up very fast. I mean, we hit level five when we started the stream. We're already like three quarters of the way through. Ooh, goodness. Okay, that's a fighter. That's a fighter. 
Oh my gosh, I need to up the brake a little bit. Come on, dude. Oh, he's a good fighter. He's a good fighter. Oh, goodness. Oh my. Okay. Come on, dude. You got this. Come on. Come on. Work your way back. Oh, he's a monster perch. He's got to be my PB right here. Some weird try fishing. Dude, I just freaking throw on a pair of shorts and get in there. Yeah, that's a PB right there. 851 gram perch. Wow. Wow. All right. Cool. And I leveled up from that. Wow. Hey, and we got some eight pound line. Okay. I won't complain about that. Wow. Play the deadliest catch game. I might have to try it. I, I want to try probably next week. We might try uh call of the wild, the angler just to see what it's like. But I've heard that game is you get through it really fast. So it's probably not going to be a, a long-term game that we play or anything, but it might be worth a try. It's starting to get a little dark. Right, right. I. It's a good question. Is it for console? The bamboo is not catching much, if I'm being honest. I was kind of worried about that. I wasn't sure what it would catch. Maybe we throw in our other rod for comparison, but... Yeah, dude, that, that was my PB right there, and it was a fighter. A two-pound fish was just fighting me. Like I said, you really start, uh, you start, start basic, dude. You start basic in this game. You really are, uh fending for your life out here like I said you have to eat you have to sleep you have to do all that stuff to stay alive so it's not easy the fishing part of it's definitely not easy either I mean only PC damn Wow, I can't believe that was our PB right there at two pounds. Can't believe that was our PB. Well, you needed a potato to run FS? Yeah. Those were the days. Those were the days. You could have a million mods and not lag out your computer. You can have a million broken mods and not really hurt anything that bad. Uh, we might move. Real fishing story? Yeah, dude, I'll hear it. Um, I think I just put my other rod down, though. Did I? Uh, do I have all my rods? I need to make sure. Yeah, I have all my rods. Okay. Here, fishy, 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 fishy. Uh, I totally went the wrong way in the pond, though. I'm kind of mad about that. Um, hear the wildlife out here? What the hell is that? TS450? Yeah. I can't go any farther that way. What is out here? I'm kind of scared. I'm not going to lie. I don't know what the hell that is. Like a beef shark. Dude, you definitely feel like you're out in the wilderness out in this game. I'm not going to lie. You definitely feel like you're in the middle of Russia. Fending for yourself out here. It's definitely a little sketchola. Definitely a little sketchola. Especially at night, dude. It's, it's kind of creepy at night. Higher mosquito elbow. Dude, what is that? What kind of animal sound is that? What the hell is that? It'd be like a howler monkey or something, right? I don't even know what that would be. 
ATS on stream? Yeah, we'll definitely try it at some point. Um, I don't know if like you're supposed to sleep or anything like that. Like I don't know how this works. I haven't tried to sleep yet. To be honest, I have no idea. Spider monkey? I have no idea, dude. Sounds creepy as hell, though. Not gonna lie. So, where's the... It must be up here at that bridge. Like a fissure or something. Yeah, I don't know, dude. It's weird sounding. Dogs barking. I'm half tempted to get out in the boat. I don't know. Only problem with the boat is there's no rod holder in the boat. So you can't fish with two rods. You have to only fish with the one. I haven't explored up this way yet either, to be honest. I want to see what's up here. What is over that way? How do you even get up there? Uh, put that away. I think you can move a little faster without it in your hand. I have not even looked up here. There's definitely more stuff up there. Can I actually go up there? It doesn't look like I can. Oh, maybe. Here we go. Uh, no. That's, there's a wall right here. Definitely some invisible walls around you gotta look out for. I don't know, very interesting. Definitely a weird spin on a game. Can I go... It doesn't seem like I can go any farther this way, but I haven't really tried. I want to see some of the other locations in the game. Like, I've only fished this one spot. Maybe... What is this building up here? I feel like this has got to be something right here. I feel like we already checked that one out. Admin, yeah. Spare spinning tackle. Oh, cool. We got we got our spare spinning tackle. Okay, so we got another old spinning rod. Let me set that up real quick. Old spinning rod. Real. Yeah, vintage USSR. Old fishing line. 2.2 kilogram. Lure. I won't put a lure on it yet. Look at that thing, dude. That thing's a classic. It's kind of cool looking, though. Uh, let me pull it out. Old spinning rod. Yeah, this thing's... This thing's hot. That's got to be like a spider monkey or something, dude. Eight years old. Crappiest open face ever. Prince Pa. Cash try real in real throw the plot. <laughs> Skating across the water. Nice dude. Nice. Uh let me help with this boat. I wanna go out on the boat. Oh. Uh I gotta buy another ticket for it apparently. My ticket expired. Boat station. Two-day rental, three-day rental. So how do I leave Mosquito Lake? Like, how do you how do you go to somewhere else? That's what I want to know, dude. I might have to Google this. Grocery store. There's all sorts of stuff in here too. You could use it for crafting and feeding yourself. So, dude, I don't know. I need to. How do I? Norwegian. Oh, cool. Norwegian sea trip. Oh, requires level four. Okay, so you have to. Oh, so you can go here free of charge. Okay, so let's go try here. Okay, so you just do it in the menu. Okay. Okay, hey, we figured it out. Mr. Peak Farms, welcome in. How you doing, dude? Let's go check out this location. I have not been here yet. So that's the first place I've fished at. It was there. Fish market's here. 
I don't know if I should try to... Let's check the cafe here. See if we should... Can't sell some stuff off. Uh, what's this place? This is admin. Um... Yeah, let me get the map, because that's probably helpful. Um, okay. I have no idea where we are. Famous inhabitants. Table of records. Okay, so this shows you all the records that people have for the area. So you see worms do well here. Blue bream. Wow, worms do really well here. Okay, let's so definitely try a worm. Got a frog off a winding rivulet. Okay. All sorts of stuff here. Catfish. What did this guy catch a catfish with? Oh, he used uh, the use there. That's uh, another fish. Catch a catfish. Okay. Russian fishing for yeah. We're trying to trying to fish. Grocery store. Getting my bearings. I haven't been to this place yet, so I'm kind of seeing what's what. Where's who? Is this the tackle store? Okay. So then where's the... This must be the cafe. Drink vending machine cafe. Okay, so this is where you could sell whatever you got. I don't have the required fish. Perch. So do I not bring what was in my net with me? Huh. I don't know. Kibble carp, I don't, apparently don't have enough fish with me. Okay, so that means we gotta do some fishing. Uh, drink vending machine. Okay, so you get some monkey cola. Drink vending machine, you get Angara. Huh. Look, another tractor. Yeah, it's almost like we're playing farming sim. It's crazy. Okay, so like, how's this map set up? So you can go, we probably wanna go, let's just follow the river this way. We'll go pick a spot up here, maybe next to the tent. Huh. Yeah, let's look like it might be a better spot for our, uh... let's try right down here. This looks good. Turn you into a monkey. I have my concerns, to be honest. Being Russia, who knows? Uh, let's try the telestick. Let's throw a worm on it. Drop that out there. It's not very deep there. Be over here a little bit more. 3:12 a.m. So it's starting to come up a little bit. Try over here, maybe. The water's not very deep, so I might not have much luck with a telestick. This looks like a nice spot. If I get the line out far enough. I don't I can't adjust the float height because I don't have the I don't have a numpad. Be out here I can get it a little deeper. Yeah, it's definitely a little deeper there. Rod holder there. Let me get out the bamboo stick. Yeah, the water is definitely moving that way. Okay, well, that's good to know. Um, let's get out the bamboo rod. A bamboo. I can't remember what kind of bait I had on this. Uh, let me pull that back up and we'll check the bait. Um, worm. Uh, oh, okay. So a couple floating rods there. Let's do. Grab this guy. We'll fish it this way. Should be able to keep an eye on those. At least slightly. Really have a bamboo rod and a freaking uh, feather on that one. <laughs> I can't believe that. Shit's wild. Probably could have made it a little better, but 
Like, I'm down for free stuff, so hard to complain. Ooh, that bobber's going for a spin. Uh, is the... Yep, we got that. Okay. Is this one too? Kind of looked like this one was going for a ride there for a second. Oh, it looks like that bobber uh, went ahead and floated itself out for me. Look at that. Okay, so we'll just keep rolling this one then. Ooh, that's going for a ride again. Okay. Nope, maybe not. Or it was and I lost it. I don't know. Something's nibbling on that stick there. Or bamboo stick. I feel like just floating it out here is a, not a bad idea. It might be better for a float here. Because they're probably floating up river that way, right? Following the current. This is definitely definitely new. Definitely a different fishing spot than we were at before. Definitely feels different in terms of like how you fish it. I definitely feel like the other one might have been better suited to spinning, but... This one definitely feels better for floating. Reel this sucker in. Maybe not casting super fars. Zoom when it nibbles. I might have to try that. Goal to catch in the game? Uh, I wouldn't say I have any goals. I just want to enjoy it. Just want to have fun. It's a nice game to relax to for sure. A lot like farming sin used to be for me. That This feels a lot lot like that where it's just relaxing you just cast it out there reel it in have fun i do want to like start learning some more of the more some more different uh bait types and equipment and stuff like that Ooh, we got something there i think i thought we had something maybe not maybe i didn't set that well type of fish do you want to catch? Uh, I'd like to catch catfish for sure. I definitely want to see catch some bass. Stuff I'd, I'd want to catch in real life, you know? Well, I'm pretty sure there's some giants in this game in terms of like what's actually in, in the game. You know what I mean? I don't know. I just want to have fun with it. Nice, nice catfish would be cool though. Ooh, the bamboo rod is definitely moving. Okay, sit this down. That might have something here going on. I can't tell, though. Something grabbed it. Here's what we'll do. We're, we're going to leave that sit like that. We're just going to slow reel it. Keep an eye on the other one in case it goes back down. Maybe that's the way to go. I honestly have no idea with this stuff. Um, yeah, I definitely want more bait types, though. I want to be able to try other stuff. I'll be able to buy a bait caster eventually, that kind of stuff. Get off the starter equipment. Ooh, that's going for a ride. Okay, there. Got him. There we go. What are you, another perch? Are you caught under the dock or what? Uh, there we go. Got him. Cool. Nice size perch. Uh, throw you back out there. Uh, there we go. Reel this one in as we're going here. Need to sit like this. Be able to reel it in. Seems like a good spot. Seems to be alright. 
Multiplayer, single player. It's a uh, single player as far as I know. I don't think there's a multiplayer to it, but there is like multiplayer elements where like you'll see what other people are catching and there's records and stuff like that. So, I mean, like there's a bit of competition to it as well in that way. Obviously, once you get to the higher, higher levels, it get more interesting, you know? It's like a whole skill tree, right? So it's, as you get better with certain things, you get, you would legitimately get better in game you know the beer to play as yeah right uh that's going for a ride there that is something's button biting at that oh my gosh he's jumped to the other one okay uh i have this one for sure there's definitely a fish on that yep another perch Uh, you probably played proficiency, I'm guessing. Um, I think that self put itself back in the water, so that's handy. I still have a worm on it. That's cool. That's very interesting. And I definitely find that, at, like, as I'm playing it longer, I'm finding more and more stuff out that's helping me get better at the game, which is cool. Might try a different spinner on this because I don't feel like we've caught anything on this in a minute. The bamboo rod is definitely not as good as the the telecast. It's like you definitely, it is definitely better equipment. But the bamboo rod will look good on the wall of my house, though, so that's cool. At least we have that. I want to throw a different bait on this. Um. Uh, Turn up the retrieval speed there a second. Get that in. Um, let me try this guy, maybe. It's probably too fast for retrieval speed. Probably need to turn that down a little bit again. Uh, bump that down to like 25, maybe. It's definitely interesting. Not your standard run of the mill fishing game. So I do want to. I think next week we'll try. Called Wild the Angler just because I want to try it. Ooh, that's down. That's down. I don't think he stayed on it, though. No. He keeps biting it, but not actually staying on. I'm going to put this one away because I'm don't. i not finding much luck with this thing. It would be a good wall ornament. Make for a nice wall ornament. Um, let me go to the next bait. Uh, actually, let's try the silver spoon here. Definitely doesn't feel like the spinners are really that effective. I mean, they seem to work, but they're not crazy good. It's definitely pretty grindy, too. I will say that. Like, you got to catch a lot of fish to get leveled up and make money. Fish aren't worth a ton of money. Stuff like that. Obviously, like, they're going to get more expensive as you get higher level, but. As of right now, I'd say they're definitely not, like, super. You're not making a ton of money early on. It's cool, though. It's definitely cool. Oh, hey, we got something there. Little perch, I think. What that is? A little perch. Another little guy. We'll take him. Doesn't hurt. Uh, let me throw that one, maybe. Probably gonna get snagged on these weeds. I can already tell. Sometimes you, you can lose spinners and stuff, too. Like, you'll have to cut them off and stuff. I haven't had to do that yet, but. Oop, there's one. He just jumped right for it, huh? My little perch. Take him. 
Doesn't hurt. So I'm pretty sure there's orders for perch and stuff in the cafe so we can make some money off of them. Try fishing with the hands? I don't know. I haven't tried, but... I wouldn't be surprised if, you t if somebody told me there was spear fishing in this game. There's another perch. Man, they're biting like crazy over here on this thing. Alright, we found the... Found the found the spinner. Keep a note on the time. 8 a.m., 7 a.m., something like that. This spinner seems to work really well. Dueling? Uh, yeah, I don't know. As far as I can tell, you can catch frogs, though, so... That's a promising sign, I'd say. Definitely want to explore some of the other bait types, though, for sure. I don't know if it's frog gigging or if it's you use the telecast pole and then set the float really high or how, how that works. I haven't tried it yet. I have no idea how to, how to do it. Might take some research. Oh, I have a fish on the line. I didn't realize I had a fish on the line. Maybe I need to lower my uh, friction brake a little bit. Especially if we're going to keep catching these little guys. There's a little display for it down at the bottom. I don't know how well you guys can see it because of the uh, bar up there. But it'll pop. Yep, I got one on right there. See? It shows up just underneath the... Uh, who's the last donation there? Is that Eric? Turn up the brake a little bit. He's a little bit bigger, I think. Definitely a little bit bigger. Yeah, this thing's catching them like crazy over here. Uh, Eyed. Yep, another cool one. 444 gram, 25 centimeters. It's like a 12 inch long fish. It's not bad. Not bad. Seems like this is the sweet spot right here, though. With a spinning rod. I haven't seen that float go down in a while, so maybe it's the it's spinning rod time. I'm sure there's different times that different things work better. Ooh, he's a big one. Hey, come here, dude. Ooh, goodness, he's putting up a fight. Okay. There we go. There's something big on the line. Probably up the brake a little bit more. Ooh, don't let him jump. Don't jump. You're not getting off of there. Come on, buddy. Ooh, I don't know what he is. He kind of looks like a cat. Ooh, he's running with me. Ooh, quit jumping, dude. Quit jumping. Come on, brother. Ooh, man, I don't know if he's gonna... He might get away, dude. He's a fighter. Oh, rig is cut off by fish teeth. No! We lost him. He's gone. He took my freaking... He took the spinner that was working. No! Oh, damn it, dude! Get out of here with that crap. That's some BS. Ah! Uh, wow. I'm pretty sure he took off with the freaking lure too. I think it was working. If we go to an eight pound line, I don't know if it'll make much difference, but damn, that sucks. Damn it. Now I'm, I'm mad, just about as mad as I would have been in real life. Wow. I got another one on the line though. Uh, another little guy, a sucker. Yeah, he was big. He was definitely big. I don't know what he was. I couldn't couldn't tell what he was. Uh, we'll take it. We'll take it. Damn, I want that guy again. Give him to me again. Oh, I got an eight pound line on there. Maybe I can fight him off better. Damn it. 
sucks, dude. Like, legit as mad as I would have been in real life if he took off with it. That was kind of thrilling. That was a pretty good little fight. Sucks that he got away, but that was a pretty good little fight. I can't believe he bit off the freaking line, dude. That's some BS, too, because it's like, what do you do about that, right? I mean, you have, obviously, just better line is all you can do. Something harder to chew through. Hard to be prepared for that. Stinks. Hey, oh well. This is what it is. Now we're not having anywhere near as much luck with this lure either. It's roughly the same color as the other ones. Uh, the other one was gold, right? I'm pretty sure. Ooh, that's uh. This just tried to swarm it right here at the right here at the dock. Okay, get him to chase it again. There he is. Yep, got him. Haha. -ha. Yeah, I mean they're they're legit. They don't just like pop up out of nowhere. They're they're legit fish out here swimming in the water. Like they, they have AI and everything. Uh, ooh. ooh, he might be, might be a little big. Uh, I don't think he's huge by any means. No, he's just another perch. We'll get him. Might as well take him. Part of life. Yep, you're right. Yeah, he was jumping all over the water and everything. Like that was that was that that felt like a legit fight with the fish. They're probably going to go late tonight. I, I'm enjoying this a lot. Enjoying this a lot. I hope you guys are as well. It's definitely definitely pretty pretty interesting in terms of fishing games, right? Nope, there's another, another perch. Right, yep. Perch will take you. Get on in here, little fella. Something new. It is. It is. It's, it's definitely something new. Cast maybe this way. Five hours into a 30 minute time lapse. Yeah, that's a, that's a lot of editing. A lot of time lapse. Ooh, hang on. What are you? Uh, just another perch, I think. Ooh, maybe a little bigger though. It's definitely a little bigger. He's not putting up anywhere near as much fight as the other guy was. Yeah, 575. That's a, that's a pretty good size. Pretty good size, uh. Um, perch there. Uh, I need to see my skills again. Oh, we have another point we can spend. Uh, 10% control of fish. We're almost uh, unlocking fishing with the spoon, I think. Develop skill to 15%, so we're at 7.7. .7. So we're getting there. We're almost to being able to use spoons. Am I, am I on? No, not on. Kind of looked like I was on for a second. I could stop for FS13. Oh, there you go. Cool. Oh, I missed him. I jumped it. I jumped it. He was on for a second. Pitch it right back. Oh, he almost, almost came diving for it. Okay, so right back, right back out there. Maybe I can get him. Slow down a touch. This is a nice spot. I'm catching them here. Nice little dock. Kind of feels like that one might have taken off by now. Hunting hole for sure. Definitely seems like it. Definitely seems like it. A little bit of action, maybe. 
Dude, I totally could. Ooh, we're on. There we go. Fish on. Yeah, definitely a good spot for a bunch of perch. Yeah, I definitely could do this all day. This is definitely fun. It's about the closest thing to real life fishing as you're going to get, I feel like. It feels legit. Like I said, I mean, when we lost that one, it literally broke my heart just like it would have in real life. Better than the cylinder. Absolutely. Fuck those cylinders. Oh, goodness. Fuck the... Oh, I have a fish on. What did you get on there, dude? Hello. How are you? Little guy. I couldn't even feel you were there. Let me turn the brake back down a little bit. Maybe I can feel them a little better. Be able to tell when there's one on. Literally didn't even realize he was on there. I really gotta be watching. It's like right above the... Right below the bottom bar for you guys where there's... Um, oh, is that something jumping right there? No. I don't think so. But yeah, right above the bottom bars there, there's like a little fish icon that'll pop up if you have a fish on. It seems like this lure is becoming less and less effective as we're getting away from the morning. I wonder if it might be time to swap it up. Uh, we'll come back to it later if we feel the need. But let me try this guy, maybe. I think it was kind of gold colored, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, this is definitely the uh, the stream to pick if you're you're not one to think about cylinders. This is definitely a very nice break stream. We're definitely going to go a little later because this is fun. I'm enjoying this thoroughly. This is very nice. I mean, you get all the nature sounds. You get ooh, fish on. Uh, yeah, you get all the nature sounds. You get the. It, it literally feels like you're reeling in a real fish. I mean, not quite as rewarding as real life when you catch something, but it's it's pretty cool. We caught our PB earlier. That was it. it definitely felt nice, you know. That's definitely nice. I will say, like, the hunter called the wild, like, I, I I feel like that's not anywhere near as rewarding as real life would be. I feel like call the angler might be kind of the same way. I feel like that might be kind of, um, it, it might not feel the same, you know, just because it's kind of an arcade style game. I feel like this being so simulated, it, it kind of feels legit, you know, maybe that's part of it. I really want to try Way of the Wild. I feel like that's going to be good. Because I feel like that's going to be pretty simulation style, you know? I don't know if you guys have checked that out at all. But it's, like, supposed to be, like... I don't know. Maybe, maybe we play that next week instead. I don't know. I'm, I'm still debating. It's either going to be Angler or it's going to be Way of the Wild, one of the two. I haven't decided yet. I don't know. Graphics could be better. I, again, if we turn it back up to ultra, it's it, it gets it looks really nice. Um, let me put it back on superior again. I, it looks pretty nice for all intents and purposes. Like it, it looks, it's pretty realistic. They're not perfect, but tiny developer and. Probably not the same kind of funding as, you know, a lot of the games out there, but. I mean, I could say the same about Hunter Call of the Wild sometimes, too. It, it looks pretty arcadey, too, sometimes, you know? Just the graphic style they went with. It does look a little laggy on stream, though, so I'm not going to keep it in this graphics quality for long. And I don't think the spinner's working very well, so let's be a good time to swap it out again. Um, okay, so let me go back down again. Yeah, I mean, it looks it looks pretty good and superior, I'd say. Um, let's 
try. Try this blue guy, maybe? Next week. What do you guys think? Do you want to do fishing or hunting next week? You let me know, because it, it depends on which. Uh, It'll depend which game I buy. I am going to have to buy a construction sim. I'll probably buy that tonight. Fishing. Maybe we do a quick little pull here. Get a boat on there. We'll leave real this in and we'll... Oop. Fish on. Not bad either. He's alright. Fish. Two boats fishing. Ooh, come on. Come on, little buddy. There we go. Here, let me throw a quick little pole in. Uh, bear with me. Pull. Next Wednesday. Fishing. Or. Nothing. There we go. Mix it up every week. Yeah, I mean, we did hunting last week, fishing this week. Maybe we do hunting next week. I, I, I'm not particular either way. It don't matter much to me. I'm pretty content either way. Pretty content either way. Honestly, just uh, not working on cylinders is making me happy. Not stressing about stuff is making me happy. Just doing something else is nice. It's a very good change of pace. Very good change of pace. It's a, ooh, fish on. Ooh, big one, big one, big one, big one. Ooh, big one. Ooh, baby, come here. Big one. Big one. Come on, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come on, fella. Ooh, he's heavy. Can we start working him back this way? I don't want to get him stuck under the dock. It definitely helps my brain. It definitely frees me up. Makes me not as worried. Ooh, my goodness, he is tearing the drag out of this thing. Come on, dude. Come on, man. What are you, dude? Come on, man. Oh, I see ya. I just caught like a glimpse of his shadow there. Come on, man. Put your butt in here. Oh, he's taking off. Come on, dude. Oh my goodness. Fighter. Holy fighter. Come on, buddy. Get in here. I feel like I'm making progress and then he freaking reels me way out. I can't tell how much line I... Ooh, yeah. That might be the big one from earlier. I think that's the big one from earlier. Come on. Come on. You're not getting away with this time, buddy. I got eight pound line on now. Come on, buddy. Yes! Woohoo! Wow. Yeah, dude. 1.087 kilos, 34 centimeters. Somebody do the conversion for me. Yeehaw, dude. Asp. Wow. Cool. Cool, cool. Nice. Yeah, we leveled up. Hard to play. Yeah, we'll give it a shot. We'll see what we think. Wow. You're nice, man. Cool. Oh, and a new spinner for it. Wow. Cool. Cool, cool. Try out my new spinner. Um, do I have it on me? This one? Kind of looks like this one. Wow. That was awesome. That was a hell of a fight right there. Wow, wow.
That was definitely my PB. Hard to play? Yeah, I don't know. We'll, we'll give it a shot. We'll fish on. Fish on. All right. I need to bring that drag back down. Just so we're not tearing up the drag on it. Cool. Perch. Yep. All right. Nice. That was a nice fight there. I'm, 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 I'm giggling over that fight. That was, that was nice. I doubt there's another one right here, but worth a shot, right? That was nice. I felt like that felt legit. I mean, obviously we're using very light gear, so I mean it's gonna feel hard, but obviously a you know a medium action rod, medium fast reel or something would be. You feel, feel alright? Yeah, not a bad perch. Come on. Turn the brake back up for you. You're not that big. You're not dragging me all over the place. Oh, 782 gram. I feel like that's that's a big boy. That's not a bad uh, not a bad perch. I'll take you. We'll definitely take you. We do have to remember we still have to stop at the cafe and uh, get rid of all these guys, but. This is a nice spot right here. This this has been doing well for us today. Definitely been doing well for us. Oop. Tishon. Little guy. Off a big. Another little perch. We'll take him. Get on up here, buddy. 144 gram? Yeah, nowhere near as big as the last one, but we'll take you. Seems like this is the spot right here. For sure. I'm gonna have to remember this spot. This is nice. That thing ain't catching shit right here, but this thing's been reeling them in. This is cool. It's hard to complain about this game, you know? It's very, uh, definitely soothing. Definitely soothing. It really feels like I'm out on the water again. I kind of want to take a boat up through here. I wonder what boat fishing through here would be like. Ooh, hey, 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 hey. Yo, Pike. Wow. Hello. Dude came out of nowhere for that thing. 1.5, 3 kilos, 44 centimeters. That's a, that's a big guy, right? Uh, 1 point... Let me pull up my phone. I'll do this on my phone. Uh, 1.5 kg. 1.5 kg to pound. Three pound. Three pound pike. Not bad. We'll take him for sure. Yeah, 44 centimeters. Pretty long too. What's, what's 44 centimeter? That's like two feet or something like that. See um, the inches. Yeah, 17 inches. Not bad. Not bad at all, especially since he just kind of came swimming up out of nowhere, huh? We're definitely getting better. Definitely seeing a, a gain in like how easy it is to catch these guys. Even with the same equipment, like it feels like we're having a much easier time than we were when we first started. Hey, fish on. Again. I mean, this spot right here is the spot. Come on, little buddy. You're just a little guy. I'll take you anyhow. 78 gram. Oh, man. Might be the smallest one today. Yep. This is the spot. Shady. There's plenty of plants and structure here. I, I, could, I could see why this would be a good spot. I imagine the water depth here is pretty good, too. Yeah. Yeah, where we're casting into, it's pretty deep. It's about the deepest spot in the pond, actually. I think I'm getting stuck on the plants there. A little hung up. No fish on, so. Yeah, I wasn't a bad pipe. New PB for me, so. 
hard to complain. Um, let me throw it back out here again. I think this is the where we need to be. It's the deepest part of the water. Might even let that sink a little bit. Then start reeling. I can't believe how late that pike was coming up to get it. Like, I almost had the thing out of the water and he came fucking grabbing it. He was all about it. I need to check my skills again, too. I think we got another skill point when we caught that pike. Could be wrong, but I feel like we did. This spot's been real nice for us, though. I'm, I'm happy with this. We'll probably go another 15 minutes and then I'll call it there, but... Uh, you know, we should probably go ahead and, uh, take all this back. Maybe put this guy back, pick this guy up, put it in the backpack. Uh, yeah, let's go sell these off real quick while you guys are still with me. Maybe we can check out the tackle, see if we can upgrade anything, buy anything new. Uh, I hate to spend money on the boats just because it seems like I do pretty well bank fishing in this game. I really didn't have much luck when I tried it on the boat on the other other pond. Plus, you could get to the deepest spot without a boat on at this location, so it might not be worth it to go with a boat on on this map. I could be wrong though. Could be totally wrong. Uh, cafe, enter. Um, uh, I don't have any crucian carp. I don't have any of these. I don't think perch. Um, yeah, I got plenty of perch. Uh, which ones do you want? For sale. Uh, this one, this one, this one. I oh, just need... No, I need more than two. I, I gotta do... There we go. Five. Okay, so I can't do that again. That made me some pretty good money doing that. Um, that was 15 bucks. We should be able to sell most of these other ones. Uh, no, I don't have any, any Chinese sleepers. Uh, let me just go over here to the fish market. I could probably sell all the rest of them. I got to sell them all because otherwise they'll go bad just sitting in my pack here. So might as well go ahead and sell them all. Although I might, I'm half tempted to keep that freaking pike or the ass, one of the two, because those two are both pretty good. Pretty good fish there. Eh, we'll just sell them. Yeah, some pretty nice fish in here, though. Chinese sleeper in there. We got pretty nice pike, ass. Perch grow on trees, apparently. I have no problem catching perch. That was 21 bucks there. There we go. For 30 fish, 21 bucks. Uh, it could be better. It could be worse. I'll take the money, though, so... Um, uh, can't get any more free tackle, right? Nope. Okay. Tackle store. What can we afford now? I think I can afford, uh, I have 40, I have $62. I'm half tempted to buy this, this lure kit. Cause they don't, there might be something good in here. And I mean, for a kit. Although, oh, there is ratings on these. I'm seeing that now. There's ratings for different things. How do I sort by ratings? So you can actually see, like, what people are enjoying using. I just realized that. That's kind of handy. Let me go into the spinners and see what's the highest rated spinner that I can afford. Um, these guys got five-star ratings across the board. Okay, so the, the most expensive spinner might be worth some money there. That might be worth spending spending some coin on. Although I hate to spend it all in one place because we don't have much. Yeah, this is a half star rating. Two star. I, it might be worth this. This one's three and a half. This one's pretty nice. This one's three and a half. So this one looks nice for 25 bucks. It might not be bad. 
So that's showing four and a half star rating. I might buy one of these. I don't know what color to get it in though. I hate to spend the money and then get the wrong color. I don't know, maybe I need to do some research on this. Let me, let me Google real quick. Russian fishing for um, lure color. Guide, choose the right lure. Gameplay elements in the UI. Um, falling aspects. Natural bait colors like if it's clear weather, use the use brown, fish color blue, stuff like that. Okay. So maybe something like this would be a good idea because it's kind of a natural color. Extremely bright colors for when it's raining. Clear night, brown, white, or black tones. Okay, so, so I almost wonder, this one might be more versatile. I don't know. It's got got some red in there. It's got some got some shine. Got some blue. I feel like that might not be a bad bet right there. I'm gonna buy it. Screw it. Um, and then I wonder if we should buy some better line. I don't know how nice a line we we have. Thirty six bucks. So keep that in mind. So we can go up to this some mono. Some monofilament. I wonder if that would be a bad idea. I can't do the nine pound because it's you know, we could. Some nine pound mono. It's blue. I don't know if that's would hurt us or anything. Uh, maybe we get it in gray instead of blue. Mono original. 11 and a half pound. We could, we could go pretty high on this. We could go like 18 pound. I don't know what our rod can do. So maybe we're upgrading too early, but I don't know. Fuck it. Let me get the 18 pound line. It's 22 bucks. It's not that bad. Screw it, let's try it. Maybe that would be helpful. And then I guess the next upgrade would be the rod, right? That, that's what we need to be working towards next. We probably need to go to um, rods, spinning, spinning rod. What's a good spinning rod in here to go for? How much of these? These are one and a half star, extra fast. Medium action. I want to go to a medium action. Siberia linear. This one any good? Medium three to fifteen. This guy seems to be the move here. I don't know though. I don't know what to go to. Just kind of planning out my next upgrade, right? You know, seeing what, what we should go to next. It's a slow. Medium fast, medium extra fast. I don't know what's a good place to be at. Probably a medium, probably a medium fast, I would say. The Siberia inspiration looks interesting. It's only, it's not a very high rating though, is my only worry with that. Four star rating on this guy. This one looks nice, 1500 bucks though. That's, that's a lot. It looks nice though. I think that's what we're gonna go with next. I should probably take a screenshot of that. Just so I remember it. And go to like the, probably this one. seems like this one's cheaper. I don't understand why this one's cheaper. It's longer. Probably easier to break, I guess. I don't know. I'm not sure I understand that. I don't know. I'm going to do some research on this stuff. 
between now and the next time we play on the game. Uh, let me go throw this lure one time, just because I want to try it. Um, give me my... Corona S60L. Let me throw this fancy new lure on there. This guy. Same time tomorrow. Yep, same time tomorrow. Let me try this one time here. Just once. Throw this in the water. See if it's any good. We already sold all of our fish off, so. Just a good little trial run here. Where were we at? Right here. Right. Uh, no, we were a little further up. Just a little further. We were fishing into that hole there. Yeah, I mean, we're figuring stuff out, right? I'll probably grind this a little bit off screen too, so. Maybe get a little bit better at it, figure some stuff out. See if this guy works. It's a clear night, so I mean, this color should work well, right? Brown, white, or black tone. It's kind of a whitish silver. Some blue and some black. I don't know. I'll mess around. See if I can't figure anything out. It's cool though. So fishing one. So plan on next week we'll do call the we'll do the angler. So call the wild the angler. I'll go ahead and get the game bought tonight and all that stuff. Get it set up. Um, oh shoot, I don't have my stream deck buttons. Um, okay, so I gotta do this manually. Intermission. Okay. All right, guys. You all have a wonderful evening. I will see you guys tomorrow. You all have a wonderful, wonderful night. Um, tomorrow, I'll probably do Big Flats, Texas, continuing to set up equipment. Um, and that's it. So you all have a wonderful evening. Goodbye.